hey there welcome to you in my youtube channel in this tutorials i am going to show you how to add mega menu with image in shopify drone theme so if you have started your online business with shopify and you wanted to design or customize your shopify online store by yourself without hiring any developer without any coding skill then this tutorial will be very helpful for you first of all i want to show you the result then the insight of this speed chart how it work then i will share the total guideline how you can add this speed chart on your shopify online store so let's get started so i have right now on my website e-commerce thesis and you see i have already published an article on my website blog post how to add mega menu with image in drone theme so here is the blog post by this time we are going to show you the result so here is the one of ready website under development i am going to reload and by default if you open the mega menu you just see the title of menu item but right now if i click on here the magic you see here is the image with mega menu this is the font in that usually your visitor or customer will see and it's very helpful for SEO because it has well described navigation. So I hope you understand. Now I'm going to the back end of this chart. So go back my Shopify admin panel. Here is my Shopify admin panel. Then I'm going to my online store. We have to wait a little bit time. Then you see I have added this chart in the latest version of drum theme so that it will work with the latest version so click on customize so if you face any issue then just comment on the below i will provide the free support for your issue okay so we are right now under customization section and i'm going to click on the header okay and in the header you see there is a option name menu type mega menu we can select menu type mega menu and menu collection image type from meta field we add this using meta field we can add or control height the collection title when mega menu image is active for example you see right now the title but if we select this one then if we click on here the title has been gone okay also it's work on the drop down menu for example if we select drop down menu we have to wait a little bit time it's work also if we select drawer then it will also work looks here okay so we're going to select the mega menu okay and we can add our control menu image size for example open it and make it 100 pixel and if you click on here it will be 100 pixel after save or if i click on here yes we have to save it so keep it as it also we can add enable border in here so this is the customization section of this mega menu p chart but right now you have to know how you can implement this p chart on your shopify online store so i have already published an article in my website you see how to add mega menu with image in shopify drone theme and here is the step by step guideline how we can start so first of all we have to create a new collection meta field with following properties looks very carefully so to do this we have to go back our admin panel very simple process you can do it okay here is the Shopify admin panel. Then we're going to follow the full guideline from e-commerce thesis. We have to create a new meta field. So click on the settings, new meta field means collection meta field. So we have click on the settings, then click on custom data, select collection. We already added the definition, definition name image you have to add this definition very carefully because if they are any mistake then it will not work that's when you have to copy the name then paste it in here 
name is kept key looks very carefully then ignore the or skip the description and the file type is file so we have selected the file okay so we have done the first step of this section then we have to add the following schema code on the header.liquid file so we have to find out the header.liquid file so i have copied this file name then go back and click on the online store click on this three dot icon edit code search file name header liquid open this file and we have to find this text looks very carefully just copy this text then ctrl f from your keyboard then ctrl v then click on the next you see here is the code that we are looking and then we have to add the following code so to add the following code just click on here to copy all the code okay okay and i already added all the code in here that's when we have done step two and here is the step three create a new snippet file name mega menu image custom liquid we have already created a file just copy and search this file name it's under snippet okay then very simple just copy and paste the code we did same then create a new snippet menu mega image custom liquid let me find we have created this file also under the code snippet or snippet folder and add this line of code then step 4 reflex code in header mega menu liquid so we have to find out header mega menu liquid so search so copy this file name and search on here here is the header mega menu liquid snippet header mega menu liquid and simply copy all the code and reflex the code in here we did same things okay then reflex header dyer dot liquid file so search this file just copy the file name and search on here here is the header dryer liquid file and finally reflex with this code okay we did same things in here then step 6 header drop down menu liquid file copy header drop down menu liquid file and reflex with this code we did same things very simple and finally add this line of code copy or click on here in the theme.liquid file after body tagline so open theme.liquid file and scroll down find out the body here is the body tag and we have added this line of code you see we have added this line of code and finally click on the save so i hope you understand everything how we have added the images in shopify collection mega menu so i hope you understand how to add images in mega menu collection in shopify drone theme and i believe now you can do this following this video guideline and using this free ready code snippet so thank you for your time to watch this video if you think this video is helpful then click on the like button and subscribe to my channel and if you need any service support relevant shopify wordpress or seo then you can contact with me have a nice day bye bye